Three men face a slew of charges after police found dozens of packages of Suboxone, pills, guns, cash, and other items inside a Lawrence County home. Police say food stamp cards were used at the home to buy drugs. WIMT's Matthew Rand has more. Louisa police say a tip Wednesday led them to the home of 51-year-old Clarence Curtis Earl. When officers executed a search warrant, they say they found several guns, marijuana, needles, and more than 100 packages of Suboxone. Yeah, you figure a Suboxone strip, an 8-milligram strip, goes for $30 street value, so if you, you know, take 100 of those, uh, you're talking $3,000 street value. Police also found paraphernalia, including rolling papers, pipes, scales, and baggies, alongside cash and a number of EBT cards. Police believe Earl was accepting the benefits cards as payment for drugs. It used to be buy uh, food for your family and that's pretty much what it is, uh, but people don't. Also charged are 33-year-old James Mullet and 37-year-old Christopher Mullet. Police call the bust significant. I believe from based on what I've seen over there that they were a, a a large source of suboxone that were on the street. Police say more arrests are expected in this ongoing investigation. In Lawrence County, Matthew Rand, WYMT Mountain News. The police chief says they will present their evidence to the next grand jury, which is scheduled for April 1st.